Hello everyone, this is Nick Renace. Today I'm coming at you with a brand new deck profile. This one is Pyro Fusion Chain Material Instant Kill. That's a pretty long name, but you'll find out why. Alright. Uh, you know what? We're gonna do what we usually do. We're gonna jump straight into the match. We're gonna hope for the best. Because there's a lot of things that can instant kill this deck. Well, not really. There's, there's like one thing that can instant kill this deck, and that's Skill Drain. And if you have a Dark Bribe, then you're good. Which this deck will has in it. Alright. Well. Not too... <coughs> Still kind of sick. Don't worry about that. Not too shabby. Dark Green Upstart Goblin will help. Alright, we're going to get the Dark Wolf player. So I gotta get out pretty fast. Uh... See, that's the part I'm not gonna like. Never mind. He's got shit, which means this is my chance to upstart Goblin. Pull a card. Eh. Alright. We're gonna go to Skafkis. We're gonna banish Chain Material, because that's the main card of the deck. And we're gonna set. Now this means in two turns, if he doesn't have something to destroy it in two turns, I instantly win. And you'll see why. Unless the guy's clever. Ah, oh, see, I don't like set things. Oh, well, it's not too bad. I'm gonna set this just because I can. Alright. I also like having like a trap or a spell. Oh, I have terraforming. So that it gives him like a little bit of leeway. Alright. I'm pretty sure this is GG. Nope. I have one. He has one more turn. God damn it. Best here. That was all right. All right. Uh, this comes to my hand now. Now I hope. Hope is the last. Is the last bit. If he doesn't have anything for chain material, I'm good. Alright. I'm going to chain this on this. <laughs> and then effect a fire hand. Okay. Good. I don't assess. Ah, uh, I don't because I don't have it. Uh, GG. I'm gonna activate Fusion Gate. I'm gonna ask if that's all right. If he says yes, I'm going to set Terraforming because it's gonna give you a little bit more damage. <coughs> Again, I'm sorry about the cough. Alright. I don't have a machine in there, but thankfully, due to Chain Material's broken wording, I can pretty much summon one, two, so, let's see, five, six, seven, twenty-one effect damage. This is how it all gets started. Alright. And then I banish this. I 
wäre ich schon so mal weg. And then I take the new take the number 21. And then I banish that one. Ah, screw it, banish him. Now, here's where the deck gets broken. There's a card that allows me to shuffle all banished cards back into my deck. Electrum. Yep. And pretty much it shuffles all the cards back into the deck, allowing you to reuse them as you wish. So again, it's the reason it's called kind of insta-kill deck is because once you get this out, they don't have anything to respond to it, dead. So again, uh, <coughs> excuse me, I always do two matches, so let's do one more match, show you it's not a fluke. I have been working on other decks like uh, Sacred Beasts and uh, Crystal Gem Beasts as well. Not too bad. Sacred Beasts are pretty nice. Uh, the, the only one I see as being good is uh, the Trap one. And there's a lot of good continuous traps out there too. Alright. And the fact that it's attack scale, that, I think that is the only problem I have with it. If so, does a fiendish chain or something, it just de decreases it to zero. No matter what. So. Wow. This might be second turn victory. Which really doesn't happen too often. Usually I have to go through some annoying way of. I always wait till they gain a thousand first. Alright, I'll draw. Now you gain a thousand, okay. This is a pretty good hand. Pretty good. Break the skill in Dark Pride. And it's game. Again, vanish, vanish. Five, six, uh, seven again. One to one hundred effective damage. And then we vanish you and you. Again. So we have that. Another machine. Now you recycle. That's all you can do right now, before we recycle. Electrum cycles.
And then you just... You do it all over again. Banish. Banish. Twenty four hundred this time. <sighs> well, of course, you banish again. And there you go. It's simple as that. So, let's go to the deck profile, which is probably why most of you guys are here. You're probably skipping all this anyway. Very simple deck profile. You have the four basic elemental heroes needed to create Electro. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, the reason you only have four, well, one of each, you're not going to be using these at all. Except for getting Electro out. Alright? Three chain material. Uh, chain material does say any time you. Chain material says any time you fusion summon a monster, you can move from play from your side of the field, deck, or hand, or your graveyard. The material is listed on the fusion monster. So pretty much, you can fusion something using anything on your side of the field. Your field, hand, graveyard, and deck. Uh, Fusion Gate just helps out. Because since this already says you have to remove from play, <laughs> well, this just makes it easier. Terraforming to get out Fusion Gate. Gold Scophagus to get out Chain Material. Upstart Goblin. And Jar Green for card advantage. Dark Prime and Breakthrough Skill is for. Well, protecting yourself against their opponents while you wait to get these out. Magical Mallet is for uh, recycling, pretty much getting better hands. Fire Hand has a good effect and is the only pyro in this deck. So, that's the pyro for your pyro machine. Uh, card Card D is also for card advantage. Usually after you have either Blue Brawler or Marshmallow on the field. And then you have Electrum, whose effect says when it's summoned, shuffle all banished cards into the decks. Something about gaining attack, but it really doesn't matter. Because they get destroyed. And this bird. So you know it's full effect. It says it requires a machine and a pyrotype. And it itself is a pyrotype. Once per turn during your main phase, inflict 300 damage to your opponent for each card on the field. This card cannot attack during turn to activate this effect. So if your opponent has a very heavy field, this does even more damage faster. So yeah, that's pretty much the uh, deck profile of the Blaze Felix Instant Kill deck. Instant kill fusion deck. Yeah. Hope you all enjoyed. This has been Nick Red Ace, and I'll see you in the next video. Nick Red Ace out!